hurting today. D'Amico Ryan's ass was just as disappointing. And as a diehard Texas fan, these are the kind of games that we should get to the point where you go into this game where you have an opportunity to win at the half and you come out and you figure out a way how to steal that game in Baltimore. I'm a fan. I love the fact that we got CJ. I love the fact we got Will Anderson. But these kind of games are games that we've sat through before where we go on the road and we don't do what we're supposed to do. I understand that the team is young and all this other stuff and everybody want to go where we're playing with borrowed money, house money, and all this other kind of fake-ass money. No, dog. Your ass go up to Baltimore and win that game. And then you playing with real money. And they had a legitimate chance to do it. I did not like the way D'Amico allowed uh, Lamar Jackson just to run free like that. Here's a stat for your ass. Lamar Jackson had 100 yards passing. You should have made his ass pass for 5,000 yards tonight instead of letting him run. Those are the kind of things with that defense that we saw that got they got away from him earlier this season. And then they got it under control. You make his ass become quarterback, Sean. That's what they should have done. I'm disappointed in it, man. But I'm going to pour me another drink and start looking at some mock draft stuff like everybody keeps telling me to do. But over the over the night, it's going to take me a minute. We might have to meet at Lizards again and smoke one at our house. <laughs> yeah. I met up with Larry at the Zards <laughs> yesterday. <laughs> that little... Uh... Little cigar, listen a little drive on the Odyssey app, and Come just on, uh, yeah, kind of hung out a little bit. Come on, now. got ready for the game. Um, and now Larry's going and looking at mock drafts. That's where we are. <laughs> we're back. We're back to getting injected by mock drafts here. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, uh, understandable disappointment. This is not the. This was not the best work put forth by Bobby Slowick and D'Amico Ryan's today. You know, that is, it wasn't their. It wasn't their best game. You know, but like. But, I mean, Bobby's kind of paddling upstream with what he's got out there right now. Yeah. Uh, in terms of weapons and tools and things like that. It felt like anything that wasn't a throw to Nico Collins was some sort of, uh, you know, weird uh, misdirection, double flea flicker yeah. sort of play. Well, you're, yeah, I mean, the people get hung up on, on that play, and, I, and understandably so. I, I get it. But, the, like, with th- this was a game to me where uh, you, the, the lack of explosion, the lack of, of speed, the, 